welcome back to my channel. Um, as I said, I am filming two videos, and today's video is going to be a what's on my iPhone 6s Plus video. I created a video about a year ago of a what's on my um, Note 3, and you can see the shatter and the terribleness. So I had to upgrade. Everyone that knows me knows I'm a huge Galaxy fan. I pushed Galaxy more than anything, but I converted to Apple. Even converted to an Apple MacBook. So it just shows that, hey, the tables have turned and it happens. So let's get started. So the first thing is, this is my phone right here. This is the case that I have. I have about three, four cases, five cases. I have a vodka bottle, pink lips from uh, Victoria's Secret, and I have a Starbucks bottle, I mean Starbucks mug that's pink, and I have two clear cases. And I have this one. I use this one because it's the most protective and it was like three bucks. So I have a floral print case. I have the rose gold color. Um, and it's just 64 gigs. Sorry, I'm looking at my laptop. I want to check something. So I'm going to be looking down from now on looking at my phone. So on my phone screen, I normally like to keep it very, very organized. I keep a lot of folders. Normally the stuff that I use on the front screens first app i have two browsers i use safari mainly but i used to always use google chrome i use google chrome to do more of re um that leaves links for stuff within my um within my email so that's what happens and then the other stuff is just for safari the next thing i have my finances so it's kind of weird because this folder is not completely finance it's just that because i have my wallet in here so i have my stocks wallet ibooks stuff i do not use at all health news mail don't use those first six apps so i have my huntington bank account i'm not going to show you because hey boom you can't even see it so who cares so that's what i have right there and then i have my gmail which i will not be opening and my outlook so i have about four different emails so next i have all my photography and my instagram related things so first i have my visco cam love this um let me just show you something quick so this is a selfie that i have on visco cam everyone knows what visco cam is but these are all my filters that i have so i have a lot of filters yes i did purchase these because i love visco cam so i didn't really mind not i mean mind purchasing them so i'm using c3 for this picture but i'm just showing you a few of the filters that you can use i might just speed this up a little bit and you could just see the different filters for Visco Cam. I do not use all of the filters, but I use a lot of the filters from specific packs. That's how that went. So you guys know how Visco Cam goes. So yeah, I just upload a photos that I want to put and then I just import it, edit it and whatnot. So now I have Widergram. Widergram is basically borders for Instagram, any pictures that you want. So I would like this picture I just did from Visco Cam. This one, this is a wide photo. So all you would do is you will have this border and you can just um, edit your brightness, but I never tweak that at all. I just keep it at zero. Editor, you can use all of these things, but again, I don't use it. So then you got this, you can change the border color, but I normally keep my border white because I like the spacing that it gives off on Instagram. And then you can change the text on here and just say um, JXO with a little emoji and then you could just you could just add that and then you can have stickers but again I don't use that at all done so you'll just save it you'll either save it to your camera roll or you'll save it to Instagram and import it straight to Instagram this way and then that's just how you do that one so next is Pixar. Everyone knows about these apps because they're not like not popular. So what you can use is I say edit a photo. I took this photo from um, I used to listen to Korean music K-pop. So I like this band called Big Bang. I'm sure if you listen to K-pop, you know what it is. This is Tai Yang. He's like extremely cute. So I'm just going to use this photo. So all I normally just do here is I use it to literally put emojis on I know that was a lot put emojis on text and that's just what I do I just do all of that so um yeah let me clear that out because I leave all my 
okay so now I have my followers I checked my Instagram followers for my personal account and I'm going to just block it out right now because I don't want you guys like on this one I make them separate for a reason so I just check my followers on here and whatnot um yeah on here I check my Twitter followers I have not been on here in forever so let's just see how this is going so I don't really check my Twitter followers at all. And then I have Sinpick. Um, let's just wait, let it load. So Sinpick, you know, oh, well, you probably don't know, but it's just basically you put a collage of a huge picture and then you have videos in this. I'm s sorry for my profanity. Let me just not show this one. So here. So... You just basically put a picture and then you put videos in all of these little squares and it just plays it and you can upload it to Instagram. I really do like that app. I think it's pretty cool. Next is Photo and I don't really use it but it's basically just making GIFs and I have a Tumblr so that's what that's for. Then I have Split Lens. Um, oh god I never rate apps. I don't care. So what you do is you just take a photo let's just take a picture then on this side you could just take a picture like this and then it just splits the effect and it gives it like a, a gradient effect type of feeling so yeah next is pick stitch which is a um collaging app and I just normally just use it for this one and then I just put two selfies together but normally I just don't even do that but I want to keep a photo collage app within my phone because I know I would need one next is pick play pick play post so this is basically for whenever I have um uh whenever I have tutorials I want to show you guys on Instagram and I can just pick wherever I want and it's for videos and photos but I would normally use it for videos and then they just play in like a collage layout then I have camera plus I don't really use this one is facetune I don't really use this because I'm not all into the editing Photoshop but I do use it to blur the background of um things that I don't want people seeing so let's just take this photo this random photo of my nails so you just do whatever and then you can smooth it out like say you have um like bad cuticles I'm just smoothing them out to make them look all nice and um you know nice and pretty Like you might not be able to tell right here, but I'll show you a before and after. So I'm smoothing out some of my nail polish because it got wrinkled, but mainly just my cuticles because my cuticles look extremely like weird. So now I'm smoothing out one of my nails because I smudged it and now it really looks good. So I'm going to just put that and then you can see a um, before and after. So this is before this is after before after before after before after so you can do that normally with your face and no one really wants to do that so I just normally use it for stuff like that when my nail cuticles are looking really atrocious so next I have my game so I have Candy Crush my favorite game of all time this is like the only game I truly play now and um, I'm on level 299 229 my bad so yeah, and then I have Time Hop, which I have this Piano Tiles game. I love this game so much. It is so fun to me. And I literally play this one song called Canon. And that's all I do. And it just, I don't know, I guess it just tests your finger reflexes. And I really just kill this game for real because it's just so much fun to me. Next I have my um, music. So I have a, a lot of music on my phone. I have mainly The Weeknd because, of course, the weekend is my favorite artist. It's been like that for a long time. I've been XO. I've been XO, like for real. Everyone knows, everyone that really knows me personally knows I really like The Weeknd. So I have all of his albums and mixtapes, except for the newest one, Beauty Behind the Madness and um, Kissland. I don't know why I don't have Kissland, 
but I don't really like Beauty Behind the Madness. I only like a few of those songs. And then I have a lot of, like I have one Beyonce song, two Nicki Minaj songs. Um, I have this whole album from Alina Barras and Galimatias. I don't know if I said that right, but it's called Urban, Urban Flow, Flora. And this is like one of the best albums I've ever heard. It's so relaxing. It's like a vibing type of music. It's vibing type of music. And it's just like one of those, like you kick back and you just play it and just be chilling. I have my Spotify, of course. Um, I don't have a playlist or anything like that. Uh, like that, like I haven't been on here since Christmas time as you see Christmas that's it like that's the last time I've been on here <laughs> then I have my Pandora I actually do listen to Pandora a lot more since I wasn't able to get milk music on this because it's not a galaxy or a Android at all I have to use Pandora a lot so these are just the stations stations I listen to so next I have my education so basically I have my canvas app which is an app for a um, for classes that you take so I only take two classes which is um, Mandarin and I don't know what I'm doing Mandarin and uh, Mandarin and my um, pre-calc class but um then i have my dictionary.com i love dictionary.com i like to see the words of the day um it's very handy and convenient you can look it up really fast but i like dictionary.com because of the words of the day you learn so much then i have my period calendar um you guys know how that goes you gals love this one then I have my regular stuff. I'm not going to click on it because I have people obviously read unread messages. So I have my contacts, my messages, my um, FaceTime, phone, and kick. Then I have my Instagram, Snapchat, Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Vine, Messenger, and Countdown. Show you guys my Twitter. So this is my Twitter. So if you guys have not followed me, you should follow me. If you want to ever talk to me like at all, Twitter is the fastest way to go because for one I have notifications turned on so yeah um, then I have my Instagram if you don't follow me on there follow me they're both official JXO I put official like no I'm not famous but they didn't have JXO available on anything because of course people that don't use the app anymore take the names that you ever, always want like all the time so yeah then I have uh, my tumblr and you guys can follow me on tumblr follow official dash JXO on um, this one, this is where I post beauty stuff and then just stuff that interests me on my other one. It's more personal stuff and I know you guys wouldn't want to see that. And then I have Vine, Messenger, and my birthday countdown. And oh my god, I'm out of breath somehow. I think I'm talking too fast. So I have 30 days left until my birthday. Whoop, 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 the big 18. Um, next I have YouTube stuff. So I have YouTube, Netflix, and the studio app, which is allowing me to... um. Look at stuff. So you guys know what Netflix looks like. Um, yeah, I was just watching Bring It On not too long ago. They've been adding some good movies um, lately. So guys, you should ch definitely check out Netflix because this whole year they're taking off. Of, like they might take off a few stuff, but they're putting on a lot of movies I like. Then I have my YouTube, and then I have my Studio Creator app, where it allows me to um, just look at comments and um, feedback for my videos and stuff like that. Then I have my shopping app. I have my Poshmark, my Amazon, my Pink Nation, my Mercy, Mer Carry, and then my Nike.com where I look at shoes that I want. Um, next, I just have like extra stuff. So I have my Kim Emoji app. I love this app. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. And yeah, I love you guys. And if you have any video wants and needs leave the comment down below and guess who's gonna make them see you guys later bye oh, I she's got the whole vibe.